Welcome to Booze in the Rocks, where we make cocktails for everyone. My name is David Edwards, and it's great to have you here today. We're going to make a limoncello lemon drop. Now, it's a variation of the original lemon drop, which was created in 1970. Now, that version actually had four ingredients, which was obviously lots of vodka, a little bit of orange liqueur, some lemon juice, and simple syrup. Now, the variation that I'm making today has only three ingredients, what makes it really, really easy to put together and give you that great flavor that you're used to with that same little bit of sweetness to make it perfectly drinkable. Now, we are gonna dress up our cocktail glass first. Now, I'm using a martini glass. Use whatever you want. So what we'll do is we will start with some white granulated sugar. You need about a quarter of a cup, and we're going to use this to dip into the, uh, dip the glass into. But to prep the glass before we dip it, grab yourself a lemon, and what we'll do is we will cut this in half and rub the edge with the lemon juice, and then dip it into the sugar. And make sure that you knock off the excess sugar. Now I've got a fantastic looking rim here. Put this off to the side. And I said this was a shaken cocktail. So grab your shaking glass. And what we'll do is we will take that lemon that we have and we will squeeze half an ounce directly into the glass. The second ingredient that we're going to use today is vodka. Now I'm using Devil's Keep Vodka from New Brunswick on the east coast of Canada there. It's fantastic, it's easy to get, it's reasonably priced too. And whenever possible, buy local. And we don't need a lot, we only need one ounce or 30 milliliters. The third ingredient that we're going to use today is limoncello. Now it is a lemon liqueur that'll give us that bold lemon flavor, but it'll also give us enough sweetness to balance everything out that we don't actually need to put any simple syrup in this. So this actually makes it an easier style of cocktail. Well, not easier, just less ingredients to work with. But we're going to use a total of two ounces or 60 milliliters. Your next step in the process is to shake this with some ice. Uh, you don't need to fill the glass all the way, but you want to fill it about two thirds of the way to about there, because you want to make sure that you have enough to get the proper dilution. And of course you want to chill it exactly the way you need it to. So make sure you slap your cup on, give it a good seal, give it a flip and shake it with a smile. Yeah. Pop that off with the strength of a thousand lemons while you start breathing heavily from how hard you've shaken this. <laughs> and then what you wanna do is you wanna put this into your glass. So how we'll do it is we will fine strain it to keep out any ice chunks or lemon pulp. Look at that, absolutely gorgeous. So what we're gonna do now is dress this up a little bit to keep it fancy with a lime wheel, a lemon wheel, a yellow thing that goes on the edge. Anyways, let's try it out. Oh, really good. That lemon is loud and proud. The vodka doesn't overtake it at all. It's just sweet enough to be a little bit sweet and a little bit lemon just like this. If you like this style of cocktail, take a look right here.